There's two guiding realities that I think our commission faces, and one is that um, we have set a very high bar under the climate change world that our policy is going to be developed in, meaning that we're going to have to look for every single opportunity we can get and then some. The second thing is we know that transportation is heavily underfunded. We're starving for dollars, so we cannot afford to uh, be cost inefficient as we go forward. We are going to have to understand the greenhouse gas, the land use, uh, the social equity, and the transportation efficiency aspects of our investments. We have a big job to do here. Um, the, uh, the project was eight years in the making. Uh, I called it too big to fail at that point in time. Uh, and I think that what we have to realize is a lot of our big projects are going to take a long amount of time but they're happening in a world in which transportation is moving very fast, and our world is moving fast, especially under this climate change. So my point is that along the way, what we supported, what the community supported with their own sales tax dollars evolved as well. And what we ended up with, which was an awkward decision for us to make, was backward technology, not forward technology, was um, the loss of an economic development opportunity to a lifeline community because the stops were eliminated, um, high operating subsidies and high cost fares. All in all, over time, this is going to be a continuing challenge for BART, not, not, not just us, uh, but BART in, in particular. But again, I say this is what, what's happening. So my point here is that um, we are going to have a hard time making decisions going forward. Keep in mind we need to be cost effective. Keep in mind we have to make difficult choices around greenhouse gases. We aren't going to be able to just say it's too big, it's been in the pipeline so long. We're going to have to really evaluate those things. And then lastly, I wanted to say we also stumbled a bit administratively. Steve and I have talked about that. There were aspects uh, of the way we handled this where we were trying to be helpful uh, and we were identified as having taken shortcuts administratively that we shouldn't have done, which is why it ended up back with our committee.